Three years after a Springfield man's murder, police say they've come to a dead end. With no leads coming to officers, the victim's family is going out on a limb, asking if you can help solve this crime and bring justice for their loved one. I had just seen him hours before, like, it just happened so fast and he just and he just gone in the early morning hours of August 7, 2011 on the front porch of his home in the 1900 block of South Wirt, 23 year old Anthony Gant was shot in the head. It was not only a shock, um, but just real devastation to our family. Gant's cousins say two days later on August 9th, things got more difficult for the family as they took the young man off life support at St. John's Hospital. He was like my big brother, like I, I really it's just, I really lost somebody really important to me. Every year, the anniversary of his death more pronounced by his birthday just five days later on August 14th. Years later, we struggle with the fact of not knowing. Springfield police say three years later, there are still no suspects, that they never really had a clear picture because of the gunman's approach. Potential witnesses that early morning blinded by gunfire from the start. With no arrests, the family is clinging to what they can. I always hope. Um, I hope for the best and we'll leave it in God's hand. As they hope for the best, this difficult month is made slightly easier by Gant's only child. The son he left behind will turn five at the end of August. Now, if you have any information on the death of Anthony Tone Gant, call Crime Stoppers at the number on your screen. You don't have to tell them who you are. They just want to know what you know.